I've always wanted to teach, so that has always driven me. And I remember <laughs> when I was five years old playing the violin and I would go in my mother's closet and she had a big, huge closet and I would pretend that I was teaching a lesson in there. So, I mean, I've always had that teaching bug. I think that at some point in my undergraduate education, I realized that you don't ever arrive. <laughs> that if you're looking to make it, there is no it. I think that's been hard, but also that I enjoy the process and the journey. And that's really what it's about to be a musician. But I would say that my playing has evolved in a natural way. Yes, I've had to really take things apart and figure out how to. Little by little, the more concerts you play, the more competitions you do, the more, the more experiences you have, you become more and more comfortable. And you can shift your attention from one thing to the next and grow. Maybe seven years ago, six or seven years ago, a group of colleagues that I was very fond of and worked with a lot in Aspen decided to form a trio. So we're called the Aspen Spring Trio. And that has really uh, been meaningful to me and has complemented the performing I do, but also the teaching that I do. There is an appreciation for it. People respond to the beauty of music. It does change people's lives in a really profound, meaningful way. I think the key to the future of music is going to be relevance. The more that we can reach out to the community, the more that we can make an impact in someone's life, the more people will realize that the beauty of music is, is really valuable and necessary. One of the things that I love about teaching is to see the potential in someone, set guidelines for them, and to help nourish their journey. That, to me, is a gift. And having that huge responsibility of guiding someone, they have to love it. They have to really, really be passionate about it and love it because it's really hard. It's possible to have a great life in music, but musicians coming out of school now need to know more and more and be ready for this journey of growing always. The level of playing and musicianship is higher than when I was in school. And the, the amount of things that you have to be skilled at is greater too. So I think that it's really a challenging field. I also think that if you're open-minded and flexible and really excellent at what you do, that there's a place for you.